welcome to The Bahamas Tonight, The National Report. I'm Kishal Adderley. Thanks so much for joining us. Topping the news tonight, chartered accountants have a critical role to play as the Bahamian economy takes a positive turn. That from Prime Minister, Dr. The Most Honorable Hubert Minnis today as he opened Accountants Week. The group is looking at how to effectively transition in a digital environment, staying current on the global stage. And as they do so, the Prime Minister reminded them that the government continues to put its financial house in order. As we meet this year, I am pleased that public finances are being restored and that the annual deficit has been reduced by half, even as we are making significant social investments in education, entrepreneurship programs, combating crime, and other initiatives to involve the lives and prospects of our people. We are dutifully paying off in a structured manner substantial arrears accumulated in the last several years. This means more money in the economy and for Bahamians who have waited for many years to be paid money owed them by the government of the Bahamas. According to the Prime Minister, members of the Bahamas Institute of Chartered Accountants will also be called upon to assist government in shaping financial policy. The government of the Bahamas has committed to the implementation of international public sector accounting standards by 2022. A primary objective of my government is the introduction of meaningful and accountable fiscal responsibility, which is evidenced by our tabling of, fiscal, of the fiscal responsibility legislation. And this legislation encompasses many forward-looking principles that will place the Bahamas on a better economic footing. <laughs> 